Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a beautiful day wherever you are. Um, in today's episode, we're gonna do a little something different. I know that uh, we love Thai food here in Bangkok and we love eating you know, Asian food, but at the same time, I also love buffets. And uh, we found this buffet here in uh, Thailand. Um, it's called the Best Beef Buffet. And it's more like a barbecue, so basically you can kind of have a you know, big old sheet, a metal sheet with a charcoal grill, and basically you grill meat, right? And uh, try different kinds of meat and different dipping sauces. So I thought it'd be fun to show you guys a buffet here in Thailand. So yeah, so we took the MRT over to uh, Sukhumvit, and in Sukhumvit we got off at Ansok. Ansok, then we got down to BTS down here to Anut. So if you're gonna go to Best Beef Buffet, stop at the train station BTS on Newt, and then we'll go ahead and walk over to the Best Beef Buffet. We'll see you there. Best beef barbecue. And then you can choose what kind of meats you want to get here. So you have a big selection of meat here. Also, we set the menu based upon the drinks too. So you can get unlimited drinks as a, I think 3.99 baht. This is a 3.29 baht. I got the Fanta orange. Also, they got the dipping sauces here. Three different dipping sauces. Also, the butter for the skillet. So you can have, um, uh, your meat not stick to your skillet. And then um, choose uh, the meats we want to get. So we got the Australian brisket here. We got the chuck roll with sirloin tip, brisket, shank. A lot of different uh, meat here. Well, also got some other things you can get here too. You got scallops here. You can get rice, wings, enoki mushrooms, corn. Yeah, you got a lot of stuff here, guys. All right, and they brought out uh, charcoals here, guys. And I think they're gonna bring over our, our pan. That sucker is uh, flaming hot. Okay, guys, what happens here is they brought over a flat pan here. This is like a small plate, the pan's not that big. And then also they brought over all the meats in our first order. I mean, they literally brought in all the meat. Crazy. And now what we'll do is go ahead and put um, the butter on the skillet. And we melt the butter on the skill here. Like that. And that way, get the pan all buttered up so that the meat doesn't stick. Also, I don't know if you guys ever had steak before, but you have steak with uh, butter. It's really good. It helps uh, heighten the flavor. So, who doesn't like butter, right? All right, this is the first round of our uh, buffet here. We're going to start all with the beef products. So, we ordered almost everything on the menu for beef. We got some rice and some beef here, kimchi and seaweed salad, dipping sauces here. Also, we got some lettuce, make some lettuce wraps. And we have a few vegetables over there. All right, here we go. Our first steak here. One thing about beef, you don't have to cook it too long, which is really nice. Look at that. It's less than probably a minute or two, and the beef is already done. All right, cool, let's put it on a plate. All right, guys, let's give this a try. So we got the beef here, and um, we got some dipping sauces here. I don't know what the dipping sauces are, but let's go ahead and try some of these dipping sauces with this beef. So I think this looks spicy. Let's try this one. A little vinegary, sour. All right, let's give this one a try. This is a different dipping sauce. Mmm, that's better. dipping sauce is really good. It's more of a soy-based dipping sauce. Okay, this is a popular um, seafood dipping sauce, and I'm gonna try it with the beef. Let's try this out. Hang on. I can see why it's seafood um, dipping sauce. Yeah, go with the soy and the garlic dipping sauce for the beef. This is a good dipping sauce, but yeah, a little bit um, vinegary, sour, um, green chili. It's really good. Also, I got this um, beef bowl with uh, rice. So I'm gonna try to make some uh, some lettuce wraps with this. Uh, this is probably uh, too big of a sum or a wrap, but let's go ahead and try this out. Mm. Mm. That was a good bite. 
So these are like uh, king oyster mushrooms. Try these out. Oh wow. <laughs> really good, huh? Butter. Yeah, butter. You know what? You know when you saute mushrooms and butter. I mean, it doesn't matter what mushroom it is. They're really good with butter. Huh? All right, guys. Here's a real, a real fatty uh, beef here. Let's go ahead and put this one in here. And cook the fat boy up and see how much flavor this one has. You know my rule, right? Fat is flavor, so if uh, this beef is an indication of what my theory is, it should have a lot of flavor. So you here you have an option to have uh, either a, uh, this plate like a hibachi style, or you can also have a hot pot where you can have the meat in the water. But I prefer grilling my meat versus that of boiling it. So your preference, whatever you want to choose. But look at that guys, it was less than a minute and this meat with all this fat is done already. All right guys, the, the fatty the, uh, meat that we just grilled is uh, Australian brisket. It has a lot of fat on here. So let's go ahead and take a taste test of this bad boy. A lot of fat here. I'm dipping in this little sauce here. Soy-based sauce. Has a little bit of garlic in there. Oh yeah. Mmm. Yeah, guys, you need fat. Yeah. Add so much flavor to it. If you come here, get the Australian fatty brisket. All right. A lot of good flavor on here. Mmm. Really good. All right, now we got the uh, seafood. So we got every seafood on the menu. We got some oysters here, the tower. Also, we got some uh, scallops here. We got some prawns here. We got some white fish here. We got more fish? I only ordered one, but... I don't know, yeah, we two came, two fish. And then we got these big, large river, prawn. river prawns. We also got Morning Glory here. Also, we had a, a tuna salad, the sashimi style. And then we also got some cabbage salad. All right, round two. So let's go ahead and try. I'm going to try um, some of this uh, tuna salad. So it has a little bit of cabbage here, a little bit of sashimi. All right, big taste test. Typical Thai. We got the fish sauce in there. The, the palm sugar, the chilies, very similar sauce. I mean, for me, I'd rather have the tuna by itself, but the sauce is really good though. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and try some of the shrimp here. And uh, they're all peeled up, ready to go. I'm gonna dip it in this um, seafood sauce. Taste test. Oh yeah, really fresh shrimp. It goes really well with the sauce. Also, they have this fish here. They call it dolly fish. It's really a unique fish. Put in the seafood dipping sauce here. Really tender. Not much flavor. It tastes a lot of the butter. The texture is very um, springy. So it's not flaky, but it's more springy, like bouncy. If you know what dolly fish is, leave a comment below. Let me know what dolly fish is. I have no idea what dolly fish is, but not bad at all. Okay, we got the scallops cooked, so I'm gonna go ahead and try some of the scallop here and uh, seafood sauce. All right, scallop here. Very sweet, very tender. A little bit of spice goes with that really well. Here we go, this is the river prawn. It's that big thing, and now, here you go. Let's try it here. This is the first time me trying the river prawn, so excited to try this. A very mild flavor. It doesn't have as much shrimp flavor as river prawn, but yeah, really meaty, really good with sauce. All right, so we um, had uh, just ordered another pound of meat, but in the meantime, also, there is a side menu, so you don't have to have just all meat. You can have uh, chicken wings, you got french fries, garlic bread, you have gyoza, <laughs> you have also beef spaghetti. 
I guess if you have kids, right? With the kids, they can have this the chicken wings and um, spaghetti and french fries. They also have noodles. So if you have that, the hot pot version, you can have noodles with that. Oh, good, thank you. All right, so yeah, so if you have um, a hot pot version, you can also have uh, udon noodles, or also you have glass noodles. You have egg, you can boil egg in there as well. So a lot of different ways you can have this uh, barbecue um, buffet. So we got the pork shoulder here, okay. Also, we got the Australian uh, beef brisket here. And then we also got the bacon here. All right, and now we're gonna cook, uh, this is the pork shoulder here, we're gonna cook that up. These are all uh, thin cuts of meat, so they're really thin and cooked fast. Here is the pork shoulder. I think pork shoulders are gonna be a little bit more drier cut of meat, but pork shoulder here. Pork shoulder a little bit drier, but a clean flavor. I'm gonna try some of the dipping sauce, of course, my favorite dipping sauce. Add another layer of flavor here. Oh yeah, there you go. Add a little bit more butter here. And now we're gonna go ahead and put the bacon on here. All right, and we got some Morning Glory. Go ahead and put that around it. We've had Morning Glory here in um, Thailand. It actually become a favorite of ours. I guess if you look at it in terms of like a, what, broccoli or like a more of like a spinach kind of flavor. Okay guys, we got bacon and Morning Glory. And uh, yeah, let's take a taste of this bacon. Here we go. It's bacon. And you know when I originally ordered this, I thought we were gonna get pork belly. And I, I didn't realize it was gonna be bacon bacon, right? And this is really bacon. Morning glory with the bacon. There you go. Great combination. Morning glory bacon. It works. Okay, and they finished off with uh, vanilla ice cream. Wow, that's actually a really good cone. Really smooth. That's really smoother than um, a McDonald's cone. Wow, this is really good. Good way to end the buffet here at the Best Beef Buffet here in Bangkok, Thailand. Okay, that's gonna be it for a buffet adventure. Um, hope you guys enjoyed that video. It was a uh, $3.99 baht per person. Also included drinks. So if you come here, you get the soda or tea. It's all included. And uh, yeah, it's right off the uh, BTS trainway. So it's easy to find. Um, we wanna try something a little different. We normally have the Thai food here, but at the same time, you know, having a buffet, that's one of our, our guilty pleasures. So having a buffet here at B uh, Best Beef Buffet was a lot of fun. All right. If you like the video, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and um, as always, we appreciate your support, and we'll see you guys back in the next video. Bye.